Welcome back to Spermy and Drebs. Who's ready for a travel vlog? We're not. <laughs> no, as you know, my husband is very old, almost elderly, which is why we are flying to Philadelphia today. Yeah, people think that SMA stands for Spinal Muscular Atrophy. No, it stands for Sexy Mature Adult. Is that what you're going with? I mean, it fits perfectly. <laughs> yes, anyway, we are going to my 20 year high school reunion. I really am old. Yeah, and we are just brimming with excitement about this upcoming flight. Oh, absolutely. I mean, there's nothing ever goes wrong when you're traveling with a wheelchair. No, I'm just hoping that the reunion at least has a chocolate fountain. Hannah, I can get us out of this. I will play the wheelchair hard and tell them that I'm sick. Shane, you use that for your 10 year reunion. Plus, I spent way too long picking out our outfits we are going. I guess we're going, everyone. Were people uh, weird about your disability in high school? I mean, a little bit, but also my high school had like six wheelchair users. It was nuts. And so everyone was very used to it. Huh, were you friends with the other disabled kids? Some of them. Some of them also had, how do I say this nicely? Ridiculous petty drama. That wasn't very nicely, Shane. Okay, we're gonna go, and we will try to keep you updated along the way. Yeah, get ready for updates like this. It's hour 15, and the airline has lost my wheelchair. <laughs> Don't jinx that. Okay, tell everyone where we're going. My high school reunion. <laughs> Spoiler alert, she isn't excited. No. Um, okay, say hi to everyone. Hello, Friendship High School. I'm not sure why you'd be watching this, but okay. Uh, for those of you most likely not to remember my name, don't worry, I probably won't remember yours either. Don't say that. Okay, sorry, just kidding. Sort of. Also, it's Samantha. All the board is time to hit the tracks. Hey fam, it's me, Ella Bella, the one you voted most likely to be prom queen for life. <laughs> Well, stay tuned for my legendary and long-awaited return to the throne. Can't wait, kisses! I do not care if that student council election was over 20 years ago. I'm gonna show them who the real winner is. <gasps> Me! All aboard, it's time to take the sky! Hey, sis, I'll text you when I'm leaving baggage claim and on my way to pick you up at the train station. Oh, and uh, wish me luck. I forgot my anxiety meds. We're having fun. Yeah. <laughs> I will be the one in the tiara. Let's rock it out and make some music, baby. Let's rock. Assistance required at gate 38. Got places to go, got places to be. We're running oh so late, still need to find our gate. Got sights to see. Got cheese steak to eat. Heading to Philly just a little while over to eat. Hit the sky, hit the track. Grab a snack. The bags are all packed. We done the email. Better go before you roll out the door. It's 10 a.m. We'll see another, another toilet bowl to four. That's just the way it goes. Everyone knows a travel day. Can be the worst. My anxiety is on the rise. I'm so surprised being overlooked by airport staff for the hundredth time. A travel day. Comes with hidden fees. You can't put on your card. Whether train or plane or bus, bus is so hard for us. us. Trying to get from A to B. Don't know why I didn't cancel. I chose misery against advice from counsel. So this is the price I pay. On a travel day. All the board, it's time to hit the track. Now boarding flight 229 to Philadelphia. All the board, it's time to take the sky. Let's fly! We're headed to our reunion. Let's reunite! Come on, let's go. Just saw the staff pop a wheelie with my wheelchair. They said to sew. Oh, oh no. no. It's time to get on the plane. I hate this part. I hate this part. I hate this part. And, and we're, we're not being vain. vain. Well, let's call it truth. Time, Time to reintroduce. I'm most likely not to care. Cringe. Cry. 
It sucks. It isn't fair. For the plane we're in the air while keeping our dignity. Pity faces stare at me. My patience starts to unravel. My peers will be so shocked when they see the one they sometimes mocked. Rolling up, feeling like a superstar. Looking like a million bucks. A Second chance to sing at the high school dance. My anxiety is off the chart. He's still my heart. My nerves are on the brink. Don't know why I didn't cancel. I chose not to think. Ignore advice and counsel. So this is the price we pay on a travel day. All aboard, it's time to take the sky. Let's fly. I can think of something, anything at all. Just move. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Hello, audience. Uh, now, normally on a normal day, I would be lifted out of my chair and carried onto the plane, but we had a day of rehearsal and our budget's not that big, so just pretend that is happening, all right? Back to the show. <laughs> oh, my goodness, bless her heart. <laughs> Oh, please let her find serenity in her horrible life. Oh, thanks and to you. Yes. Yeah. Uh, hell is other people, as they say. Oh, hey, looks like we're doing the same live reading. Yeah, look at that. Book twinsies. Did you just say book twinsies? Yeah. And I can see I'm going to regret that for the rest of my life. <laughs> OK, he is hot. <laughs> I'm going to get some sleep, if you know what I mean. Hit me if you need me. Ryan. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Exclusive Airs Flight 229 with nonstop service to Philadelphia. Please settle into your teeny tiny seats and turn your attention to our teeny tiny video monitors. We got a great deal on eBay. <laughs> and now for a message from our CEO, Mr. Cobby Vandeveer III. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for flying with us today. We have some important announcements before we get on our way. And since it is crucial that everyone understands what we say, we will we'll tell, tell you, you in English. And I will repeat it in S M A. For your convenience, restrooms are located at the front and rear of the cabin. For your inconvenience, you won't be able to access them. In the event of an emergency, your seat may be used as a flotation device. And throughout the flight, your seat will be uncomfortable. No one cares like we care. No one listens to you more than we do. That's the core philosophy that all of us here share. No other airlines care like we care. <laughs> Please make sure to set your seat in the full upright position. And we'll make sure you spend your flight in a quite uptight condition. We offer comfort and tranquility to every single soul aboard. And if you have a disability, we'll make you feel like you're a roll aboard. Wine and enjoy. Relax. It's all designed to 
to aggravate and annoy when you don't feel safe. No one cares. <laughs> when your seatbelt shake. Like when you need assistance. No one listens to you. Sorry, that's more, more than we do. We swear we'll get you very soon. So maybe not intact. <laughs> but hey, we like to act like <laughs> we can. Oh, thanks, hon. And if anybody pleads and begs, I need my legs. We'll say sorry, read the regs. They say your chair can't go in the cabin, no. We gotta sew it down below. And though you bubble wrap and double wrap that chair, still it's gonna be battered, banged, and bent beyond repair. Once you've done the bathroom math, we have a hunch you'll skip the boozing. We've got your seat buckled, passengers. We know you'll do it well before your door. And then we'll ask if someone fastened yours and treat you like a four-year-old. Oh, oh yeah. yeah! When your nerves are frayed. No one cares. When you need some aid. Like we care. When you try to mention. No attention will be paid. You'll be left without a when somebody has SMA, we know it's rude to stare. So that is why we try to stay completely unaware. As we always like to say, here at Exclusive Air, with our dedicated flight team. And at times it almost might seem like we care. Just doing the good work. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> wow, that was weird. Mm -hmm. Please fasten your seatbelt. It's going to be a rough one, folks. Oh, great. Oh, whoa, 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 is this your first time flying? No, no, but it might be my last time living. As I always say when I realize I've voluntarily chosen to get on a metal death trap with wings! Oh, so you're saying you're enjoying this experience? No, not really. Yeah, no, I got that. Uh, 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 oh, I'm sorry, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, so, have you ever been in a plane crash? What? No, knock on wood. Okay, then you know there's probably nothing to worry about. You're probably doing a lot of heavy lifting in that sentence. You don't worry about anything? I worry that my chair will come back in pieces. Uh, so nothing important? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, well, my sister actually uses a wheelchair, so I, I, I get it. Huh? Well, not totally, obviously. I, no, I, I could never really... I'm gonna stop talking now. Hey, at least you didn't say that you were in a wheelchair for six months and you totally get the disability experience. Yeah, I did stub my toe pretty bad last week. Oh, then did you get it? <laughs> Can I get her anything? <laughs> yeah, just a Diet Coke. Two, two Diet Cokes mm -hmm. and a bag of pretzels. <coughs> Thank you. Thank you, hold this. Hold that. Hey, these pretzels are for you. I find it helps when I'm double fisting or triple fisting, in your case, drinks. Ah. You caught that? I did. Ah. <laughs> Not that I'm judging. Yeah. <sighs> uh, uh, hey, if you hate flying so much, why are you going all the way across the country? Oh, uh, well, it, it's my mom's 70th birthday, and uh, if the turbulence doesn't kill me, the guilt trip I'd get for missing it would. Uh, you must be going someplace special. I, I mean, you look beautiful. <sighs> he said in a very chill way. <laughs> Uh, thank you. Uh, no, it's actually my high school reunion. Oh. I made a bet with my friend Anna here that I wouldn't win the free plane <laughs> tickets and the uh, hotel package the Alumni Association was raffling off, but lucky for me, I lost. Yeah, yeah woo! So, instead of working on my company's fall formal wear collection, I get to wear it to a gym that I never even went into with a bunch of people I don't even know anymore. But hey, it's a day off, right? Uh, well, you know, they'll know you, though. What? Uh, I'm pretty sure you're the only one in your class who was just seen in the Forbes 40 under 40 to watch list. Oh, God. In fact, I know you are. How would you know that? 
But I, I recognize you from high school and Forbes. <laughs> I, I was two years ahead of you. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't recognize you. Oh, uh, no, uh, that, that's okay. That was 20 years of therapy and an unfortunate set of frosted tips ago. And they say people can't change. <laughs> right. <sighs> you okay? But yeah, no, I just realized you totally made me forget to be nervous. Yeah. Thank well, you. Sure. It's probably the, a lot of booze that you had, but yeah. I'm really glad you sat here. She sat in a very chill way. <laughs> Ah. All right, everyone's going to off to a fantastic start. Yeah, so they told us that Shane's chair won't fit in the cargo door of the plane, so they're going to try to rebook us. Hey, there's a nice indoor play area. This big guy's getting antsy. This is actually my husband. Yeah, he's almost 40. Oh, oh, that's beautiful. Like I said, fantastic start. Couldn't my heart beat any faster? This is sure to be a disaster. Why'd I let you talk me into coming to my high school, school reunion? reunion. You haven't mentioned the outfit Fit for a queen Don't I know it? Perfect look when I'm going places Can't wait to see their faces It's a union queen 20 years later Who's got time for haters? Reintroduce me I'm not the person you knew In fact, I'm feeling brand new Ready for a high school reunion I know we used to be Easy to tease The butt by the joke But the joke was on you I made it through and I'm stronger Friendship High Class of 04! Yeah! So what have you been doing the past 20 years? Tell me everything. Well, uh, all right, so the week after we graduated, I visited my brother at football camp. And then in August, I went over to Colgate University. Go Raiders! And uh, yeah, I met my roommate Brad. And my mom and dad took Brad and I out to the Colgate Inn. And then after Maybe dinner, you- Maybe tell us a little less of everything or we'll be here till our 30th, okay? <laughs> Wow, being back here makes me feel like I'm in high school again. Ooh, without the acne. Uh, speak for yourself. Are you using the cream I bought you? Yes. 
I think TikTok may have lied to you. Uh, TikTok never lies. I have it on good authority. Whose? TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> what is she doing here? Who? Oh, damn. Okay, Samantha Grant, you wear that dress. <laughs> I mean, if you're into that sort of thing, which I'm not. Yeah, whatever, like, she sucks. Yeah, ugh. Can you believe people used to mistake us for each other? But why? She's not even fierce. I know, right? Ridiculous. <laughs> we, were, we were in Spanish class together, don't you remember? See? Si. See si who? Okay. No, Lauren. You're Brian, right? See? Si. Oye, 20 años. No puedo creer que ya han pasado 20 años como pasa el tiempo, oye, y tú te ves igualita. ¿Qué le pusieron esta bebida? Exactly. <laughs> Salud. Yeah, <finish. laughs> anyway, so my husband Peter, who works on Wall Street and makes tons of money, has his personal assistant read Forbes to him all the time. And who does he see in it? You. Oh, remind me what you do again. Oh, I'm a fashion designer, which <gasps> it, it says in the article. Yeah, oh, right. Mm. Oh, and you used to go out with that haughty Billy Tompkins. Oh, no, no, no. That was Ella over there, the one that looks like a disco ball. Oh. Oops. <laughs> well, congrats. <laughs> so where do you live now? We just bought a house in Wildwood with a hot yoga studio attached. Wow. Oh, I just can't get it up. Feel my butt. Feels like a bowling ball. You know, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Oh. Well, have, have you ever tried hot yoga? You know, I can't say that I have. Oh. Well, it's just divine. <laughs> so. <laughs> oh, oh, is that Sherry Perkins? Oh, I hear she just married a lawyer. Can never know too many of those. <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope you and your wife have a good time. Oh, actually, I'm not her wife. I'm <gasps> her friend. Love is love. <laughs> Am I right? <laughs> Wow, <laughs> yeah. she's a lot. Oh yeah, and 20 years later, she still can't tell the difference between Ella and I. Oh yeah, the local influencer you were telling me about. Yeah, she really is a legend in her own mind. <laughs> I mean, her outfit is really uh, shiny. <laughs> so, there's something I've been wanting to talk to you about. Okay. For literally 20 years. Dude, what is it? Just tell me. I'm, I'm sure this may come as a shock to you. Spit it out. I'm gay. And? That's it. That's it. Oh, that's it. <laughs> oh my god, wait, is that hot plain guy with a sequence fanny pack? Wait, what is, what is he doing with her? Um, maybe they're in sequence anonymous. <laughs> okay, not a good time for a joke? Okay, sorry, my bad. I know, right? I do not recognize literally anyone. <laughs> Let's face it, time marches across people's faces at different speeds. I mean, not yours though. You look exactly the same, Lexi. Well, don't tell her that, because I'm Natalie. Awkward. And now, a word from your favorite teacher okay. and mine, Mrs. Worth, Mom, oh, come on down. Looks like someone's hey, having a blast tonight. Am I right? <laughs> hello, hello, class. Most likely not to come to their 20th reunion unless bribed with free tickets. <laughs> We're so glad that worked. Now, welcome, and on behalf of all your former teachers and me, I am so happy to see most of your faces here. <laughs> okay, so don't go too far away because in about a half an hour, we are gonna be giving out awards, including my personal favorite, Best Dressed. I think we all know which Forbes 40 Under 40 Superstar will win that one. <laughs> Enjoy, and yes, the punch may or may not have a, something a little special in it. You're welcome. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. I mean, Mrs. Worth. And now, in Friendship High Tradition, we welcome back our beloved senior prom queen. Oh, time to address the subjects. <laughs> Off with their heads. Uh, oh, wow. 
It is so great to be back here, everyone. It is like we never left. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I had the best memories of our time together, especially during my reign as your queen. My queen! So, I made a little slideshow for you guys. Hey, Greg. Oh, oh. oh nice, nice. Yes. Bounce a quarter. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh. 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 Um, oh. What is that doing in here? Well, you can take the girl out of Philly, but you can't take the trash out of the girl. Well, that literally makes no sense. <laughs> Come on, let's go. No, no, just ignore her. Let's stay and have fun, okay? Okay, fine, you're right. Okay, well, wasn't that fun, everyone? And now I'm gonna beat you all to the punch. Ah, see what I did there with some class updates and share some huge news with you all. I am auditioning for the reboot of Project Runway, and you are now all a part of my audition tape. Wave to the cameras, everyone! Hi! No! No! Oh, oh, oh! We can throw the vote just like we did when you ran for prom oh, queen. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's all right. Your mom paid each of us ten bucks. Oh, no, um, um, well, well, it was it was for a good cause, after all, right? <laughs> Look, okay, all right, folks, let's actually get back to what we came here for. Cocktails, right? No, mother, the dancing. Okay. <laughs> Look, my buddy James here wrote a song back for our band back in the day. Three automatic doors down. James, come on up. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, boy, <laughs> You're ready to rock, everyone. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> Things I wanna do, I'm gonna make them true. The will is strong, I knew it all along. Don't try to box me in, I'm here to win. The life ahead, I have been dreaming. Of. I'm proud of who I am, no one I'd rather be. And I am worthy of anything and everything. I'm proud of who you are, who you're gonna be. You will love the song that you're gonna sing. Spaces, spaces. I leave my mark upon these places Spaces, spaces You can see it on my face, yeah I'm not invisible, I'm an original I'm so much more than what you see or what you bargain for Spaces, spaces I'll make this world a better place, yeah Spaces, spaces Typical answer, you think you're so much better than me, don't you? Wow, whatever this game is that you are playing, I want none of it. Come on, Anna. If there's one thing you see, it's my humanity. I won't miss a beat because my passion's deep. This has in front of me the possibility. I'm an original, I'm so much more than what you see or what you bargain for. Spaces, spaces, I'll make this world a better place, yeah. Spaces, spaces.
Yes, they rebooked us after a very long night in the airport. Not many places to fly down and get comfy in the airport. No, and lots of places to buy alcohol, which Shane certainly enjoyed. We did pee. Yes, and there are not many accessible restrooms, but we're gonna try this one out. As only reading is suck. Yes, we're gonna go try to get some sleep on the plane and hopefully make it soon. I hope everyone is having a fun time at the reunion. So, you used to come here a lot? Yeah, if a lot is after band practice, choir practice, chess matches, my aunt's funeral a lot, then yeah. <laughs> Lots of memories, huh? Yeah, and history seems to repeat itself a lot. God, I'm so mad that I still let that girl get under my stand after all these years. So she's always been that horrible? Yeah, the only difference is, like, tonight we talked more than we ever did in our entire four years of high school. Wait, how is that possible? I don't know, it's complicated. <laughs> hey, Ooh, there you are. Oh, hey, hello, hi. Uh, what are you doing here? Did you for forget your fanny pack? Yeah, no, no, that uh, was for my kid sister, which, uh, you know, sort of completed her whole outfit, which she also left at home, so. Oh, you're, wait, your kid, kid sister? sister? Yeah, look, I know you two weren't exactly besties at school. Yeah, we were pretty much the opposite. But you should know she really looks up to you. Right. Oh, she does. She won't say it out loud, but she really admires the work you do, you know, and how successful you've become. You know, this whole Project Runway idea, you know, she's wanted to get on that show since she was a kid, and yes. seeing what you've accomplished has made her stupidly and insanely jealous, sure, but also really inspired to just go for it. And I think she could really use your advice. You know, as someone who's made it happen for herself. So that's why you came to see me? Well, yes, no, but... No, it's fine. You, you don't need to explain yourself. You know, the thing is, Ella and I, we don't even really know each other. I mean, to be honest, I always thought that if I kept my distance, that people wouldn't try to compare us as much as they always seem to want to. Same. What, have you just been sitting there listening to us this entire time? Uh, enough of it, yeah. Um... I assumed you hated me because you always ignored me. But I guess I was doing the same thing to you for the same reasons. Ryan, give me a drink. Uh, yeah, come on. How about we just... I was no, 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 let's go. So... So... Yeah, I, I shouldn't have said that you were a pity prom queen. That was pretty shitty. Um, you didn't, and it's okay if you thought it. I'm sorry that I assumed you were a stupid, stupid, selfish, conceited cow. You know, that was kind of shitty. I was most likely not to want the spotlight. I just wished to be seen as unique. It was easier to say that somehow you got in the way than simply find a way to speak to you. I was most likely not to have the courage to make a move or offer up a hand. I had never claimed my right I stayed small and out of sight But today I understand That I can start again Have a change of heart Turn around And let my story start on an empty page Let's reset the stage for something Though the past can't be erased, there is no more time to waste. From now on, what we should do is start 
our tale begin on an empty page let's reset the stage for something new where there's room for both me and you let's go and take up some room let's cut each other some slack let's not let others assume we can be stuck in the back let's make our choices our own let's not Confront things alone Our story started long ago And now we truly can Grow and start again Let each other in Turn around And let our tale begin On an empty page Let's reset the stage For something new Where we're the most likely not to let others define us and their friendship between me and you. 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 Listen, I uh, probably wasn't that easy to talk to back in high school. I was listening to a lot of My Chemical Romance with the headphones on. <laughs> Plus, I was so jealous that you were dating Billy Tompkins. God, I wonder what happened to that guy. Oh, well, I could ask him. We've been married for 10 years now. Oh, no way. Yeah. <laughs> Do you ever wonder why every disabled kid went to this school? Yes, it is so bizarre. Right. Uh, do me a favor, put my brother out of his misery and go talk to him. He's liked you for like 20 years, <laughs> and it's really a bit sad. You can do better, but make your own bad choices, okay? I think I can do that. Shane, where are you guys? We made it. Where is everyone? Uh, we're at the after party. Oh, Shane, I told you it ended at nine. I thought you said 19. You thought I gave it to you in military time? I know. I thought it was very strange as well. That would have made it even earlier. Do you not know military time? No, I don't know military time. Oh, my God. Hi, do I need to be here for this conversation? Just come over to the diner. It's just getting started. Yeah. Okay. So... You've been pining over me since we were teenagers, huh? Oh, uh, but, but, you know, pining isn't the word that mm. I'd use. Uh, admired? Adored from afar? Not in, like, a creepy, you might be featured in a Netflix true crime show way. <laughs> Good to know. Yeah. You didn't think to mention that once on our six-hour plane ride? Oh, no, I, I did. Uh, several times. But, you know, we were finally getting to talk, and I don't know, it felt like destiny. You know, plus, you know, there was something going on between us. At least I, I thought there was. No, there was. Maybe we should start over. Reintroduce me. I'm not the girl you once knew. I'm still that guy with a crush on you. Then kiss me. Okay. At the last reunion, <laughs> this is the last call.
want to get out of here? Yep. Yes, absolutely, I do. Mm -hmm. He said in a very chill way. <laughs> Well, we made it. <laughs> we survived our 20-year high school reunion, barely. No, but seriously though, I, I found out so much tonight. Like, some people change and some people do not. And maybe we're all just doing the best that we can to keep our spirits up one day at a time. You know, to be honest, I think I'm most likely not to be let an old grudge ruin my evening and most likely to live my best life. <laughs> Like the boss that I am. Anna told me to say that. Okay. <laughs> Bye, everybody. <laughs> Our story ends as it's just starting. Looking forward as we're departing. Come what may, live as to me, my way. The final say, each other. Coming?